I started in epidemiology somewhat by accident, actually. My background is in um, more um, lab science. Okay. And I did some traveling in, in Asia uh, for a few years, and I saw how public health in general might have an impact on, um, on people and on the health of, uh, of society. And so it got me interested in public health in general. And uh, the more I started learning about public health and saw you know, all the different interesting aspects of it, the more I realized that epidemiology was really, really interesting and, and could actually influence um, public health. I was very, very fortunate in discovering that there was research that I was interested in being conducted here at the University of Alberta and uh, Dr. Karen Goodman, she's my supervisor, and the research team that she's leading is doing work in Northwest Territories in Yukon, working with communities that are concerned about uh, Helicobacter pylori, a bacterium that is um, a known risk factor for things like peptic ulcer disease and stomach cancer. And it was the community-driven nature of this work and the, um, the fact that communities were voicing their concerns and working with researchers and health professionals that really made me interested in, in joining the team. Mm -hmm. There were uh, many, there are many different aspects to this research program that I'm involved with. One is the microbiology component. Yeah. And uh, rather than having uh, us researchers uh, go up to the community and strictly um, sort of share our, what we've gained through this process uh, about this aspect of the research, um, that happened with, with a microbiologist and an anthropologist. They went to the community, they um, talked about what it is they were working on and the results that, they, that they've seen so far. But in addition to that, they worked with a local planning committee to um, um, identify two young women who then came to Edmonton and learned about the microbiology aspects and other aspects of the research program here in Edmonton. So they went to the lab, they learned all about how, um, how H. pylori is, is grown, um, they learned about uh, Cross Cancer Institute and what people who are experiencing cancer from the north might experience when they're uh, in Edmonton other aspects of the research program here. They put together a presentation and then they presented that to high school and other members of their community when they returned. And so they were able to share their experiences and what they had learned about the research and the research program in their own words. So it was really a fun thing to be involved with and uh, I learned a lot in the process as well. Yeah.